Have you ever wondered how the human species have been obtaining knowledge since the beginning of their evolution? Well, for the longest time, the most common learning method involves annotating and memorizing. This method has been proven to be quite effective, but in this modern day and time, is it nearly enough? As technology has become an integral part in our life, there are also more equations to solve. And this is when the STEM learning method comes in handy. STEM is a learning method that integrates the usage of the field like science, technology, engineering, and finally, mathematics. This method is better because it is encouraging the student to participate in projects that require them to use their newly obtained knowledge from the aforementioned fields and put it into reality. Today, our team will elaborate on how we can utilize this learning method in our academic curriculum by use applying it in social studies, natural science, and finally, what students can obtain by using this method on a daily basis. So please stay tuned and watch the first part with us. STEM has proven its second importance in teaching social studies as a topical focus for STEM by tasks. A key way to do that is to focus on social study discipline rather than history. STEM show great propensity to help kids respectfully consider the engineering fields of the past in contest with the resources available in our time, especially in Vietnam. Just imagining how simple machines may have been used to build spectacular monuments really opens our eyes to how wonderful and incredible engineering of the past really was. Furthermore, other technological advances, such as the cotton ring or the uh, electric light bulb, both have important societal implications. With them, students can understand the interaction between science, technology, and world events. A perfect embodiment for the situation can be seen through the fact that the electric light bulb has been called the most important invention since man made fire. The electric light bulb helps us to travel and walk safely in the dark, to extend day life into the night, and to establish social order after sundown. Without this invention, there would be no night life at all. Regarding literature, students can bring out characters and settings to life by experimenting same skills in classroom. Instead of just reading the test and asking questions monotonously, Teachers can help students use game skills to be a model of characters or commit building challenges. Let's talk about science subjects, about chemistry. Students examine the chemical products with the supervision of teachers uh, when studying the international symbols. After getting insight into the knowledge, students can move on to doing some fascinating experiments such as making a fast old snack with saying sugar and a lighter or turning milk into plastic with some basic ingredients. When it comes to physics, um, STEM can provide students opportunities to practice a lot of know-how about forces and energies that they usually learn in classroom. Building a telescope or building a popsicle stick comfortable is a good example for this. So, when it comes to some skill that students can obtain, here are two or more essential STEM skills for students. Firstly, is problem solving. Everything in life can be considered a problem in solving. Having a joint to resolve issue is a crucial part of the step of STEM. For students, is it a must for a lot of their work. Apply the concept into a practical project, and they're more likely to connect the dots. Secondly, we talk about teamwork, which is ability to go other way with others to achieve a goal. And you know, in this day and age, there are a wide variety of applications such as Google Doc, Google Slide, or Canva, which facilitate the students to work productively. And that's exactly what STEM is all about. In conclusion, for the overall reasoning, it can be interpreted that STEM, unlike the misconception that it can only be used in natural study, it can also serve as an indispensable role in obtaining literacy and social study. Therefore, to satisfy the requirements of the modern workforce, STEM should be encouraged on a daily basis in academic circumstances. To further demonstrate the idea, we would love to introduce you to a mini-play starred by the English major student of Digital High School Philippines.
um, all talking about the importance of STEM in several aspects of life. Let's begin. Back. What happened? I thought we already had a revision session last week. Yeah, we did, but these things are just too hard to understand, you know? Like, we can't even know the structure of carbon. We can't even see it. Yeah. Well, I have to admit that chemical structure are like super abstract. But call this a your lucky day because we have a surprise for you. See, we know that you've been chocolate with chemistries. So we decided to make this for you. So in the past few days, we've been thinking of ways on how to, you know, make um, natural science a little bit easier to digest. And we have come to the conclusion that the best learning method is to visualize things. Wow. Which is why we made this. This is a mini structure of a carbon particle. Using it, you can have a better grasp at how it works in the in, in natural environment. Therefore, understanding it better. Oh really? I'm so excited to see that! For example, this is a hydrogen bond and this is a double bond. Can you see it now? Uh, well, oh yes, finally I can see the differences between those conceptions. You are a lifesaver. Thank you! Shall we? With them, we, we can, can do it! it. 